Hi, welcome to Volatility 411 for Monday, December 13th. I'm Russell Rhodes from EQ Derivatives and the Kelly School of Business. Uh, I'm coming to you from the lobby of the new SIBO offices in the old post office. What a great place SIBO has moved into. All right, for the markets, early today, the S&P 500's down eight points to around 4703. VIX is up $1.31 to 20. The December contract is at 20 and a quarter, just a little bit of a premium, and I'll talk about that in a second. And the January contract's up at 2260. Now, a note about the December futures and options. Uh, this week is triple witching week or quadruple witching, depending on who you talk to, uh, which means a majority of the standard options and futures in the equity markets expire on Friday. However, the DEES VIX futures and options do settle on the open next Wednesday. So the December contracts will be trading after this Friday for a couple of days. Uh, that probably explains that really narrow premium of the December future contract relative to spot VIX right now. Now, taking a look at this coming week, it's a big week. A lot of people say it's the last big week in 2021. We've got a Fed meeting on Wednesday. We're looking at about a 97% chance that they're not going to change interest rates. Uh, it was 100% until about a week ago. Probably not going to see a rate hike on Wednesday. However, everybody's going to be paying close attention to the language. And the odds of a rate hike in 2022 have been moving up. Uh, right now, we've got about a 60% chance of seeing a rate hike as early as May of 2022. And then the odds are better than 50-50 that we will have three rate hikes or 75 basis points of hikes uh, by the December 2022 meeting. So, so that trend is something to definitely keep an eye on. And then finally, taking a look at some trades, uh, a couple of bear call spreads. Somebody sold the December 22 calls, bought the December 25 calls, took in a credit of 35 cents. And then somebody going up a little bit higher sold the December 30 calls, bought the December 32 and a half calls, and took in a credit of only 11 cents. Very confident that we're not going to be above 30 uh, between now and next Wednesday. And then finally, the most active VIX option on the tape was the December 45 calls. Uh, within the first half hour of the day, they traded 12,000 contracts. I'm pretty certain that some of those were done in the extended market hours before regular trading hours in the U.S. So with all that, I'm Russell Rhodes, and that was your Volatility 411.